Hi everyone. So this video is what I got for Christmas. I wasn't sure if I was going to do this video or not, but I did get a couple things that are related to this video, so I decided I would put one up. This is basically everything that I got. I may like have a couple things left out, but I'm pretty sure that I have mentioned mostly everything. Um, excuse my hair. I'm going to take a shower after this, so I just had to like throw it up and it's disgusting. And it's not staying down. It's one little bump. It's just annoying me. So I got a mixture of clothes, makeup, and that's like pretty much it. I got a lot of that stuff. I got like a few here and thing. Uh, I got a few little things here and there, but I'm not mentioning all of it because I got a lot of stuff and I don't even know if I have everything, which I probably don't. Just putting this out there, this video was not bragging. I do have a lot of stuff here, but I go to about five houses on Christmas. I celebrate with my grandparents, my dad, my mom, my sister, and my aunt. And I also got things from other um, family members, my aunts and uncles. So uh, it's just a lot of stuff put together. Um, I'm not bragging by any means. I literally didn't even ask for anything this Christmas. If you don't like people talking about the stuff that they got, then don't watch. So the first thing I want to mention is my new camera. I don't know if you can uh, tell. Oh my god, my hair is atrocious and like this sequiny ugh, ponytail. Oh my god, it's disgusting. But I did get a new camera. My sister got me a new camera. I wanted one that like a lot of people use, but it was like $500. But she found me one very similar. Um, this is the box. It is a Samsung DV180F. It looks like that. And the one thing that I wanted was that it has a screen on the front so I can see myself, which is why I am not looking directly at the camera. I am actually looking at the screen, which is probably not good. Um, but as you can see, there is a screen on the front so I can turn it on and I can see myself recording or you can see yourself when you're taking a picture. Um, I don't know how much this costs. I know she got it off Amazon. I will leave the link and I'll leave everything that I can try to find in the description box below. So yeah, that was like one of my big gifts that I got and I love it. I don't know how it's going to look. This is my first video using it. So hopefully it turns out really well and it's a lot better than my computer or any other thing that I was trying to use. My other camera was horrendous. So I'm sorry, I keep looking at this thing. It's like, I gotta get used to it. So I think I'm just going to like jump into, I don't know what I want to do. I guess I'll do clothes. So the first clothing item I got is this country music shirt that I actually asked for. Um, it just says country music on it because I love country music. Uh, I asked for this because it was like really really cheap. A website or something wherever I saw it. So my aunt did get it for me so I was really happy. Um, this is the brand called Chaser and they make really cute stuff and I just I wonder if it's backwards. I don't know. But it's really soft and it's like really cute and comfortable. So that was the first thing I got. I'm not going to do this in like any kind of order. But. Another clothing, clothing item I got is just this white shirt with glittery elbow patches on the back. My other aunt got this for me and she lives in Virginia so there's no brand on it but I could probably try to find something similar. I definitely saw something similar with elbow patches, sequiny or sparkly in Lord and Taylor yesterday. So I'll try to find that and show you guys that. This I got from my older sister. It's just this tank, this like halter looking tank and then it has like a keyhole back. And the cool part about this is that it's reversible. So you can wear it black or white how I just showed you. Um, and this is from Express, I know that. That's just really cute. This little tank here is from my mom. And I'm pretty sure this is from Marshalls. And it's just like this suede looking material. And then it just has like a seamed front detail. And then the black is just plain. It's really soft and comfortable. I wasn't sure about the color with my skin tone and my hair. But I kind of like the tan nude look. So I'll have to see what I can pair that with. It's all tanks, but like seriously, I'm sweating, I have a tank top on. It was 70 something degrees on Christmas, as you probably all know, because it's just been like crazy weather. 
So I actually think I'll get like use out of those and I won't have to wait to wear them, which is pretty cool. This I got from my older sister as well. It is from Target, I think she said. So it's just like a dress. It's long sleeves, has a collar, it's a button front, and then it's just this really pretty florally print. It looks kind of hard to see on camera. It has like these gold buttons and like a pocket. And it's like a dress so you can wear it with tights or with leggings. I haven't tried this on yet, but this is like really pretty. This um, is from J. Crew. This was from my mom's flannel. It's just like a really soft, thick flannel and like these really pretty colors. And then she got me two tanks to either wear under it or just to have. I don't know if I would wear these under, I might, but I haven't tried it out yet. This is pretty royal blue and then this pretty mint color, which these are also from J. Crew. So she gave me these two to kind of like match and go with the flannel. This is from my mom. This is by the brand Chaser as well. It's just this really interesting knit cardigan. It kind of looks like an old man sweater, but I kind of dig it. The color block sleeve. And it's just like really soft. I thought it was like so interesting, like the knit of it. It was just really cool. And I love this brand Chaser, by the way. And that is from Marshalls. This is also from my mom. Another flannel. I love flannels, so if you didn't know. Um, this is just a black and white, which I've been wanting a black and white. I have so many colored ones, and I really just wanted a black and white one. Sort of with leggings or whatever. And this is from Marshalls too. This is by the brand Rails, which I have mentioned before in a video. I have one flannel from Rails. And they are kind of pricey, but this is from Marshalls, so um, it wasn't as expensive as they usually are. And this is like a little bit thinner. It's almost more of like a summery layering flannel. So that's just really cute. And I can't wait to wear this. This is inside out because I've already worn it about three times already. This is from Victoria's Secret. This is from my aunt. It's just like a plain v-neck shirt and then it has this mesh detailing on the sleeve in the back. This is like super comfortable. I've seriously worn it a bunch of times. It has like a seamed back um, and it came, I know because this is a gray and then she got my sister a tan color. So we'll probably be sharing those. So got me, it's um, the brand Simply Southern. It's just like a cute preppy brand. Um, I have another shirt from them, but the cutest part is the back, which just has like a Jeep on it, which I love because I drive a Jeep. And it's just like really cute. The last clothing item, I think, is this jacket that my mom got me. This is from Marshalls as well. She buys every we buy everything from Marshalls. You should probably know that by now. This is just like a, not leather, but it's like a coated denim um, bomber looking jacket. It just looks like that. And it's like this navy dark blue color. Lint on it. Um, it just has like a collar and it's just like a throw on. I love jackets like these. They're like cool and um, they're just cute to like throw on if you're going to a bar or something. This uh, is the brand AG, which is Adrian Gold something. Gold something. Gold Schmid. Um, yeah, this was not $295, by the way. That's the original price. Um, but this was from Marshalls, and this is like kind of a big gift because this brand isn't very cheap. So, but I just thought this was like really, really cute. And that, I think, is it for clothes. Moving on to makeup. Oh, I guess, actually, no, I teased you. I'll just do jewelry really quick because I have a few things. First thing is this necklace and this matching bracelet that my aunt gave me. This is from Victoria's Secret. This little thing is from my cousin that he picked out. This ring I got from my sister. And this is from my aunt. This is a BCBG necklace, which I love like a bar triangle and then I have one very similar and I love these necklaces these long like Y necklaces 
I think that's it for jewelry. Um, so yes, now we'll move on to makeup and some stuff. The first I got was this was from my mom. This is a makeup forever. I'm assuming it's limited edition. Fifty Shades of Grey kit. Um, just looks like this, and then this is everything that comes in it. So I already opened this already. So it just comes in a really cute box like this. By the way, I never read the book of Fifty Shades of Grey. I literally just saw like most of the movie like maybe two weeks ago, and that's all I know. I think she just bought it for me because Makeup Forever is a good brand and it was just like cute. So I don't have anything to do with Fifty Shades of Grey. I know it's like weird, like my mom would buy me Fifty Shades of Grey, but we never even read the book or watched the movie, so. Um, this is the front, which is so pretty. This box, oh my god, these papers keep falling. And then, uh, I just noticed the other day, it says like the words and stuff, because it's like kinky, but uh, just says like words, I guess from the book or something. Just because I just used that. Oof. This is when you open it. So it just has a couple pieces and then this little door. So you can use the box after you take all the makeup out and then it just has like a mirror in it. So it comes with a mascara, which I'm using, which I love. This is the Makeup Forever Smoky Extravagant uh, Mascara. Lip gloss, which I'm also using. This is the Makeup Forever Lab Shine Diamond Collection. A lipstick in natural and this is I'll swatch this for you it's like a really pretty mauve color an eyeliner which is a graphic liner with a felt tip and it comes with a four quad eyeshadow palette just looks like this and this is like really nice packaging everything's like really nice and like um you know the packaging's like really kind of like expensive looking and it's not like a crappy looking kit that you get together it's like really nice so it comes with like this huge mirror which i thought was like really nice and then it has the makeup forever packaging it comes with a four quad palette and i don't think it has the colors but there's like a lighter color which is that a brownish this is like a mauvey smoky which I really liked and then this is like a dark brown color so they're all really pigmented they're really pretty they're all right up my alley these are the colors that I use every single day and I just love the box it's just like really pretty box and this kit I think was like $50 so it wasn't cheap um, but Makeup Forever is like a great brand, so I'll try to see if I can find this kit for you. Moving on, my dad, my dad, yes, my dad, uh, I gave a list with like a couple things that I wanted, and one was the Lorac Pro 2 or 1 palette with all the eyeshadows. I've mentioned the uh, Lorac To Go Pro palette that I have that I love. So I mentioned that I wanted the eyeshadow palette and my dad of all people got it for me he got my sister a Lorac palette and he got my other sister a Lorac palette but they're like all different he was like oh yeah i checked it out and he's like they had a couple interesting things so i like picked a couple out so i was like okay so he got me the Lorac 2 palette which i haven't opened yet and i've been dying to open i'm probably gonna do a look with this um i'm so excited there were two different palettes i don't remember which one was which all i know is that i liked that it had half shimmer half matte which is what i wanted it for it comes with the eye primer in there and then it's so pretty it's like there's no better feeling than new makeup so all of these i'm so excited you have no idea so excited these are all so gorgeous like, I can't wait. Like, this navy color, I don't even wear navy, and like, I'm dying to use it. So, we have buff. Oh, am I gonna swatch these? I'm gonna swatch these. Alright, 
hold on to your seats. Okay, so here we have them. So we gotta do this. All right, now I'm confused. This is buff. This is light brown. This is cool gray. This is nectar. This one is plum. This one's navy. That's charcoal. And this one is black. This one is snow, beige, ro rose. Ooh, I can't wait to use rose. Mocha. We ran out of film. Chrome, silver, jade, and cocoa. And yes, these are all my hairy arm, but these are all the colors and I love them all. So that was like a big gift that I cannot wait to use. Next is a little perfume diffuser that my mom got. I have one already that I love. I, uh, you pump the, you take the little top nozzle off any perfume and you pump your perfume and you take it on the go. I love this. I don't even use perfume bottles anymore. I only use these. She got me this Laura Geller Glamorous Eyes two-piece set, which comes with a mascara and a sparkly kind of top coat. I haven't used this yet, but I'm, I haven't used anything yet besides the Makeup Forever I used a couple pieces. I can't wait to use all of this. I'm definitely going to be doing reviews. Oh my god, I'm so excited. A refill of my e.l.f. brow kit, which I desperately needed. This, which is like my ultimate favorite brand for hand creams. This Bliss. She got me a two-pack, which I already used one of them, of course. And it comes with the Lemon and Sage, which I've used before. And it comes with this really good smelling uh, new scent. It smells so good. I don't even know how to describe it. It's called Snowberry. So that is like a two kit. I love this brand. This brand is awesome. This Aphorism Brow Book. I don't even know what this is, but I used the wax in it the other day. It's just for brows, but it comes with like all the shades and like brow wax, a highlighter, a pencil, and a brush. How to do your whatever your brows but I just thought that this was like a really nice kit this little soft touch tweezer which is awesome because it has a flashlight I don't know if you can see that but so if you're doing your brows it has a flashlight so you can literally see it like 10 times better so I can't wait to use that and just these Style Essentials Nail Polish Remover Wipes because she knows I do my nails probably like two times a week. And these are like good on the go if like you get a chip and it's just all downhill from there and you just want to wipe them all off. That is all for makeup. I got a nail polish, which I am wearing, an Essie nail polish. It's called Perennial something. I'll have to link it. Some I don't remember the name. Perennial Nude maybe? It's a nude color. I know it's called Perennial something. Uh, I don't remember. I think that's it for makeup. If I forget something, I'll just put it in the description box. I don't remember. I, I tried to be like really good and like not use things so that I could show you and then like not make a mess. Last two things, I mentioned this in my gift ideas video, um, but it is what something I got for Christmas, a pair of wild box sunglasses, which I did ask for new sunglasses and these were one pair that I did want. So they look like this. I mean, they're not everyone's style, so. I just thought they're really cute. I love them. They remind me of like the 50s. They look like Lucia Ball, but they're just really pretty and they come with this really cute little box. Last but not least, my mom, of course, like all these gifts, but like mostly from my mom because she's just crazy. Um, but she did get my sister and I new bags. She got us both Kate Spade bags, each different styles. She got my sister a crossbody, which like we'll probably share. Uh, we're good about that. Like we just use each other's stuff whenever. She got her black crossbody, and she got me a black tote looking. 
I am not a big fan of Kate Spade, I have to say. I have like a, I'm like a handbag whore. I love handbags. But I did want a new black one. And it's, she picked it out herself, which I'm pretty impressed, I have to say. Um, but I just thought that this was like really cute. So it has like that crocodile print. It has a Kate Spade in the front. It has the top handles, which do go down, which I like. So they're not always in your way. And then it's just, I have like so much crap in here. I've already used it. A big tote and then... One thing that I love most about it is like the zippers go all the way down. So it's so much easier to get in and out of it. And it does come with a long strap. And that's it. This is like so messy in here. So that was my recently big gift. Um, but I didn't ask for, I really didn't ask for any of this besides that makeup palette and the sunglasses. Um, but I believe that's it. I think. I got a couple other things like I said, but like it was just like a mug. Um, some like soap and whatever. A couple like little things that I didn't feel like mentioning. Um, but that's like the majority of everything that I showed you. Once again, this isn't bragging showing you everything that I got and I believe that it's like useful to show you because then I'm gonna probably do like reviews on everything and what I like I share and I share what I use and what I think is a good brand and clothing and makeup and everything so yeah let me know thumbs up if you enjoyed this video we're gonna see how this camera works out sorry this is a lot of stuff gotta get through it fast and I'm like gotta wash all these off I think that's it so thank you so much for watching I'm gonna go wash my hair now and I will talk to you guys soon bye mm -hmm.